Hey, bro. Hit my intro. What's happening, my visionaries? It's your man, J. Rock. I'm back in effect. I'm live and direct, and I'm coming at your neck with that ain't nothing. Video, 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 baby. Ah. The video, man, as always, just like, subscribe if you want to. If you don't, then just do it if you want to do it, because Jesus said this is the right thing to do. What's happening, my visionaries? It's your man, J. Ron. Back up in the stand. We need another video, man. Live and directing, y'all already knew with some faith no more. Oh. So, this is, we got Malpractice from Faith No More off the Angel Dust album. Y'all let me know, by the way, if I have not reacted to all the songs from this album, because I feel like I have. As a matter of fact, hold up. I'm going to check in. Let's see. I know I've done Midlife Crisis. I've done Smaller and Smaller. I've done Caffeine. I've done RV. I've done Everything's Ruined. I've done Kindergarten. I've done Jizz Lobber. That was a very interesting song. So I think the only thing I haven't reacted to, I'm about, I'm about to do Malpractice. I haven't done Be Aggressive, Crack Hitler. I'm pretty sure I did Midnight Cowboy. I haven't done Land of Sunshine and I feel like I've done a small victory. So I think I pretty much reacted to all these songs except two, well, except Be Aggressive, Crack Hitler, and Land of Sunshine. But I've just about heard every song on this album. I gotta say my favorite so far is Everything's Ruined. Um, Caffeine, Jizz Lobber, though it was insane. I liked it. Um, yeah, that's all I can think of right now off the top of my head. Anyway, we got malpractice. So let me put on my headphones of truth. Bam, we gonna do what it do. Let's do it. It's not like the person in this uh, ear is using the, the pick on the guitar, the mute it, the mute the strings, muting the frets, and then doing this very loud, on, uh, doing it really up close to the microphone. They kind of added some treble to it. And then add it on this side. Hold up. Yeah, then like on my my left channel, somebody's like scraping maybe one of the strings on the guitar. Like if you take the, well, it doesn't sound like that. It could be. Maybe you're taking something. Maybe you're taking the pick and kind of stretching and kind of uh, moving it over the the string on the frets. It makes kind of that sound, this chord, and it kind of sound. See back to it though. Heavy tone of the script. Pattern change. Time to get the switch. Not about six, eight, seven, eight. Alright, this is definitely a Faith No More song. Hella, hella, I just spit all over my damn screen. Hella saturation. Um, hella saturation, like hella, hella distortion, hella tone, hella bra just brazen and just so forthright. And, and, it's, and it's just in your face, like, motherfucker. That is a perfect physical representation and embodiment of what is faith in the war. Just uh, <laughs> let's get back to it.
highest power. Love this little synthesizer. Synth pad. Nice breakdown. Glock and Spiel, xylophone, whatever that is. Nice random. I'll be at before preceding that bar. It was the drums doing the at the end of the bar the double the dun 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 off that riff at the end of the bar. But then on this next on this next bar, it was the guitar that was doing it. So it would go dun 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 dun. That's nice. Now it's back to the drums. Um, to me, it's like atypical archetypal faith no more, man. It's got the heavy riffs, heavy tone, nice, interesting transmissions, always keeping it engaged and enthralling, kind of being always unpredictable. And I always think about, man, how creative is this band, right? Because most of the stuff, I'm just thinking, I just ponder my head, like, how the fuck did they even come up with this? How did they sat down? They must have been smoking the angel dust that's, that they, that this, uh, you know, album is named out there, because I just don't understand how they sit down and, like, Maybe it's Mike Patton, so he might have came up with most of the things. But I feel like these other dudes are pretty. They they gotta all be creatively on the same in the same spectrum to to play this kind of music and not be like, what the fuck are we playing? Because it takes kind of a a level of creativity to be like, okay, whatever. I mean, just try it. Let's see what let's see what happens. And that's the beauty of it, right? That's the, that's how cool it is that 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 could be produced from from this. So yeah. Like it, man. It's got some heavy riffs, a lot of saturation. Um, like that little part in the, in the middle of the song where it broke down and had that little part where Mike vocalized and the kind of the xylophone or glockenspiel, whatever it was. But they always keep a good mix, man. It's always it's always keep you engaged. So I enjoyed it. If you like it as well, man, go ahead and leave a like. If you don't, then you don't. I can't force you, man. But as always. This is I salute to you. Remember, always say blessed, never stress. Remember, always, always do your very best. Live love, love life. Because why? Because life is beautiful. That's why. I'm going to catch y'all on the flip side. Deuces. I like to get high. You can tell by the eye. Flying the friendly skies is all there is to do. Now that it's close to the end, I don't want to touch ground. I like it. I like it. I like it. E. <laughs>